Good morning, students. In EVS, we will do our ninth chapter, that is our home. Our home. We have already known that there are our many family members live together. That is called home. There is there are pakka uh, house as well as kacha house. That we know our home. But what is home house? Now we will know. in different parts of our home right let us read the chapter we all live in houses the house in which we live with our family is called a home living together teaches us to love one another it also teaches us to share work and the things in our home There are many rooms in our home. Each room have a different use. As I told you, our home, our house, जहाँ पे हम रहते हैं, and the house, all the family members live together. That is called called home. Living together, teachers uh, love each other, respect each other. It also called home. Okay. it also teaches us to share things work hard together live lovingly in home this is called home and also where we live that all the every parts are have a different name which we know easily where we are okay like if i say please bring me a book or please let or let's watch television or we welcome our guests after welcome there we sit let the let the guests sit okay that is what we will know what is their different parts of our home so let us see a picture this is the home and outside we can only see the structure but what is inside we all will know what is inside our house so first let's see which one the first part is drawing room we sit and talk to our guests in the drawing room we also listen to music or watch television in our drawing room so what is drawing room drawing room where we welcome our guests and let our guests to sit there there are a uh, television and there we can watch and play music listen music okay watch television it's called drawing room let us see the picture you know clearly a picture is living room drawing room or hall it has sofa different art and plant television okay where we welcome our guests after welcome we let our guests to sit in our living room and next room a study room where we do our studies we have table one chair and books a lamp study lamp okay it is called study room and some the smell is coming right where from okay mama is cooking some food mama cook the food in kitchen kitchen have refrigerator utensils jisme bartan bolte hain and fridge refrigerator and food the delicious food what we eat what our mama prepares right we all love food and it is prepared in the
kitchen. Kitchen has gas stove to cook food. And we will sit together in our dining room. Dining room is where we eat the prepared food with our loving family. Right? That is called dining room. Okay? First, mama cooks the food and let in the dining room to eat the food. And next one is bedroom. Bedroom where we sleep. Okay? It has a bed. That is called bedroom. Bedroom be where we sleep. Where we take rest. We are tired in the whole day and take, take rest. And feel comfortable in the bedroom. Right? Next thing. Next is bathroom. Bathroom where we brush our teeth. Where we take bath. Right? That is called bathroom. After every morning we brush our first work is to brush our teeth. And then we go to bathroom to take when there we feel fresh, right? Okay. Take bath. When there we feel, then we should keep our things at the proper place. We should keep our clothes and books in cupboard and on shelf. We must keep our home neat and clean. So at the last, we put our things in a cupboard. Shelf where we put our books in a proper way, cloth in a proper way and that is also a place. Like we put toys over here, we can put our cloth, we can put our important papers in cupboard and shelf, right? So we must, we must, we must do clean our house, always should clean our house to not let the bacteria and harmful things come to harm us. Okay? I hope you learned the chapter properly. So please take the chapter 1. Thank you. you 